Hey guys, Rain Moonwolf here, and well, Happy New Year! It's. Ugh. There's no way around it. 2020 fucking sucked. It just sucked. Ugh. I mean, oh boy. I don't even know where to begin with how bad that year was, because. I mean, I've had a lot of issues last year. But, at the same time, I can't deny that a few good things actually kind of came out of it. Um, so, why don't I go ahead and talk about some of the good stuff that happened last year, and then, afterwards, I guess I'll go ahead and talk about one of my plans for 2021. So, this is sort of a look back on the past, the good of the past, and then focus on the future of what we should do. I guess one of the good things that I could say happened last year is that, uh, well, first off, I found out that I was trans, basically. Because for the longest time, I've been, kind of, I've been kind of having some struggling issues trying to figure out what my orientation is, and, well, as you can see with my shirt, yeah, I'm trans. Uh, well, Let's just say it just made me very, very happy. Like, you have no idea. Uh, another good thing that kind of happened is that uh, I kind of made up with a friend that I had a bit of an issue with a couple of months ago. Maybe it was closer to a year, in fact, that I kind of had a dispute with them. We had been friends for like 13 years at the time, and, well... One bad argument led to us not talking to each other for about a year. It kind of caused my old YouTube channel to kind of just crash and burn, and... Well, a couple of months ago, I, I kind of went over to his house one day with one of my other friends, who was also friends with this guy, and we kind of talked it out. Let's, it was rough, to say the least. And, well... Regardless, we made up. We're friends again, so... Yay! Another good thing that kind of happened last year is that I finally started seeing a therapist. Because I kind of suffer from a few, like, violent mood swings. Like, from one moment I'll be happy and, gi and giggly and cheery and woohoo! And then the next moment I will flop into this bed and... I will not be getting out of it until the next day, pretty much. Because, yeah. I've had several types of diagnoses saying that I'm either bipolar, or I have borderline personality disorder, or I know, although some people just say I'm autistic, or schizophrenic. I, I, regardless, I need a proper diagnosis, and while I'm seeing this therapist for my behavior and stuff to try to help me mellow myself out, I do need to actually find like a proper person to get me diagnosed to figure out what's wrong with me and, well, hopefully I can start doing steps to improve myself and, for the most part, kind of figure out what I can do for you all. Because one of my main things is I want to be there for a lot of other people, but most of the time, my mental state kind of prevents me from doing that. But again, it's kind of, uh, it's a slow process. It's a slow burn. It's a slow everything, to say the least. But yeah, that's kind of the stuff that's kind of happening, that uh, happened in 2020. For this year, I kind of want to make more videos. That's kind of like my big resolution is to make more videos, make more art, make more content in general for you all to enjoy. Whether it's whatever I do on my art um, on my art page or whatever I do here. The main thing I want to do for this channel is basically I want to put a smile on everyone's faces. I want to make everyone feel happy and fluffy and cute and I just want to send some positive vibes to anyone and everyone that I possibly can. And if I can do that, then I've accomplished my goal. I... It's a slow process. I'm slowly building up content. I'm slowly figuring out what to do with this camera and my YouTube series. The Pokemon Sword Let's Play was supposed to come out around... Well, it was supposed to come out next week. 
But I needed a new microphone because I was having audio issues with just using my inboard Mac microphone. And, well, it just means it's going to take a little while before I can actually bring that content out to you. But hopefully it'll be worth the wait. And hopefully I won't stutter like a madman last, last time. Like, ugh. I'm doing it now. My, I had a problem with recording the last year. The last time I tried to do Pokemon Sword was I just kept stuttering and stuttering and stuttering over every single line. And uh, it's hard to read and talk at the same time. You have no idea. I think my brain just doesn't like me. Anyway, I need I need to be positive. I need to focus and hopefully the next video. The next time I record, it'll be better. And, and of course, I do want to do more Pokemon content in general because that's kind of my passion. Like, I know you can only see like the Kalos uh, uh, poster right here, but I have so much more Pokemon memorabilia in this tiny, tiny room that you have no idea. I've got plushies over there. I've got books right here. I've got Amiibos over there and posters strewn all along the walls. But you're only getting a small glimpse of my room. And maybe I'll do a, like a room tour, although that'll take like five seconds. Heck, you probably saw most of it when I did my first suit unboxing video. <laughs> That's pretty much it. <laughs> but I, I noticed that I've got a lot more passionate and energetic when I started talking about Pokemon. I guess that just shows that uh, that's where my real energy lies, because giving these somber kind of update videos aren't really my thing. So once I get my uh, microphone and the like, I'll start working on like more Pokemon related videos. Like I do have plans to do that top 10, well not top 10, but top 5, I only have 4 fingers on this paw. Derp. But yeah, I'll be doing my top 5 least favorite and favorite Pokemon from Generation 1. Um, yeah, that's going to be like my next project after I do the how I got the how I got to the furry fandom video, which I feel like is an almost obligation at this point because I'm pretty sure every furry YouTuber does it. But I guess that's it for this episode. Um, it's kind of been uh, it's been another off script kind of off the cuff video for me. I'd like to try to actually make a script or at least some bullet points that I can go off of. So, future videos might actually have more structure and, well, might be less rambly. Eh? But yeah, until next time, this has been Rain Moon Wolf, signing out. Later guys, and have a good day. Bye!